Hey my loves, welcome back to Between Us Tarot. I hope you guys are having an amazing day so far. Whenever you come across today's video, and as you can see, we are going to be looking at a lighthearted message from spirit. So yeah loves, um, I just got this idea just because I know some of you guys were letting me know that this week's energies were a bit intense, okay? So I just thought that, hey, let's look at some lighthearted messages. So this is going to be a fun reading. I think this is going to be a very beautiful reading because um, I did let spirit know to keep it light. You know, that's just, and I don't know, I really got called to do like this, this kind of topic today, okay, loves? Uh, and yeah, and there will be a love reading coming out tomorrow. <laughs> so stay on the lookout for that, loves. But I just thought this one was more important for today. <laughs> so let's get into it. We have three beautiful piles in front of us here today. So we have pile one, pile two, and pile three. For pile one, we have this beautiful um, green adventuring, okay? This is going to be our beautiful pile one. For pile two, we have the beautiful moss agate crystal. Okay, this is going to be our beautiful pile two. And for our pile three, we have the beautiful tiger's eye crystal. So this is going to be our pile three. And I will give you guys uh, a few seconds to pick your pile or piles if you are feeling called to more than one, okay? And with that being said, loves, I'm going to go ahead and start with pile one. But if you guys need more time, please feel free to pause the video. Hey, pile one for you guys that chose the green aventurine. Let's go ahead and see what is the lighthearted message that spirit has for you today, okay? And I hope you guys are doing well. Let me know down below how you guys are feeling, how you guys are doing. Um, yeah. <laughs> we have the king of wands. We have the five of cups. We have the four of swords and we have strength. Okay. Ooh, I'm already, yeah. See, this is why I was excited to do this type of, or this topic today, because I knew it was going to be some beautiful stuff. We have let your light, let your light shine. Positive movement forward. Yes. <laughs> uh, we have thriving. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hmm. This is such a beautiful message already. And then we have 10 of swords. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. And just give me a second, pile one, to look at your message here. What is it? Yeah, what's this lighthearted message all about here that spirit is giving you? Okay, pile one. You're like, okay, wow. So what spirit is letting you know is like, just keep going. There is something that you're about to like, this could be in any area of your life, okay? But honestly, what you're mess like the message that's coming th out for you is like, you will be successful. I'm, I don't know. I'm getting a sense that whoever picked this pile, some of you guys are kind of worried like, um, yeah, in some sort of aspect of your life, okay, it could be career, it could be work, it could be, like, love, it, honestly, just maybe even struggles within yourself, okay, whether, like, anything, emotionally, mentally, like, things that you're going through, okay, pile one, I'm seeing that the divine is saying, like, keep pushing forward, because you are about, like, you're about to embark in something that, uh, like you're almost there like you're basically at the final step i'm seeing that who yeah for those of you guys that chose this pile like you guys have gone through certain steps you guys have learned maybe certain lessons okay and you're right around the corner of like like kind of hitting the jackpot okay and 
the biggest message that I'm getting here, pile, pile one, um, is you guys are getting like some sort of recognition. Okay, just give me a second. Yeah. Mm, this is so beautiful. I'm seeing that maybe some of you guys, um, and you guys still like, cause I am picking up that for most of you guys, you guys still could be going through maybe some sort of like kind of being stuck in the past. Like, oh, this didn't work out or that didn't work out. Or like, I made this mistake. I feel that that, uh, I'm so sorry, loves. Hopefully my dog doesn't keep going. <laughs> um, okay I think we're good but yeah kind of like that type of energy like maybe even regretting regretting like certain choices that you guys have made or uh, I'm just saying that yeah some feeling low because of certain choices you guys have made or you guys could be overthinking for some of you guys I am picking that up here okay just feeling low like I'm seeing you guys feel low because maybe some things haven't been moving um, in a certain direction that you've wanted them to. Okay, pile one. But really what Spirit is saying here is like you're almost there. Like you're almost there, pile one. Like what you guys have been through. Like the suffering that you got. Because I have, I am seeing here that maybe you guys have suffered a bit. Okay. Like you guys feel weighed down. You guys have gone through certain endings. Okay. I'm um, seeing this within yourself. But it could also be like in your environment. Like certain things have ended. Okay. Like, um yeah certain cycles could have ended in your life okay whether that was a job um maybe some sort of way that you were thinking i'm even seeing that this could still be going on in your life pio one okay again you guys could be at any phase in this situation here but what spirit is wanting to let you know is like your answers are being pr uh and your your answers <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. Those, your prayers are being answered. Okay. I am seeing that like deeply and I'm seeing that the universe like they just want to like they're caressing you at this time whether you feel it or not. Okay. They're like they are at a yeah like in the 5D like they're holding you tight. They're answering your prayers like you're gonna see big stuff pile one and the divine is not taking your case lightly. Okay, like I'm seeing like this King of Wands as a spirit guide, okay, making like very determined spirit guide here. For a lot of you guys, you guys could have a main male spirit guide, okay. Um, for some of you guys, this might even be your higher self, honestly. Uh, I'm not talking about genders, just just um, energy wise, okay. Someone very determined to make your wishes come true, pile one. And I am seeing that whatever you guys are worried about, some of you guys, it could have to deal with you thriving, with you being successful, with you maybe getting noticed or getting recognized, uh, maybe in some sort of work aspect. For some of you guys, I am picking up like a work aspect, okay. And for others of you guys, this is just you like make like establishing yourself okay maybe becoming a little bit more independent uh financially or uh just in your life okay just within yourself for some of you guys it could even deal with you becoming stronger within yourselves okay but the divine is letting you know like this is coming <laughs> um keep moving forward you guys oh my god yeah you guys are healing so we have ten of wands um uh, <laughs> Uh, judgment yep yeah a lot of you guys don't like when I say that that you guys are healing like I'm tired of hearing that message <laughs> that's okay um yeah healing is definitely not an easy process and I mean it takes time it's different like the timing's different for everyone honestly um Okay. Yeah. Wow. My pile one. You guys are very strong people. I just have to give it to you guys because this whole journey that you guys have been on, honestly, I'm seeing like it's kind of been like a, a roller coaster, a roller coaster. Okay. Yeah. But and some of you guys like could still be feeling down like oh, my situation doesn't look that great. Like, is anything ever going to move forward? Am I going to get to where I want to get to? I'm getting like that type of energy. Okay, pile one. And the divine is also letting you know that you're becoming a brand new person from like, 
excuse me, these experiences that you've like gone through, okay, that you've been going through, like they're not in vain, okay, they're for a reason. I am seeing that you guys did learn something like maybe right now you're not seeing it but in the future you're going to be like wow I did learn so much from for because of like the struggles that I went through um yeah I'm even but you are moving forward like I said pile one like there's and some of you guys may be a little bit on guard not all of you guys but I'm picking up like maybe a small portion of my pile one you could be thinking like oh my god something bad is gonna happen next like I'm not gonna get there like maybe letting fears come up but pile one let me tell you the spirit like I am seeing a very strong spirit guide here that's protecting you that's making sure that you move forward because it's like the spirit guide is almost coming through saying like that my child did not go through all of this to to not succeed <laughs> okay that's that's kind of what i'm seeing here pile one i'm also seeing you guys in like your emotions i'm seeing yeah a lot of a, a lot of cards here showing your emotions so pile one like don't um don't suppress your emotions if you want to cry cry because i am seeing that that will help you heal Okay, there is a message here that if you feel low, cry. If you feel angry, let it out. If you feel frustration, let it out. It's okay. Um, you, you need to release it, okay? Like, uh, of course, make sure that you're not in that state uh, for long periods of time, okay? Like, obviously, sometimes we can't help it, of course. But... Um, like if you can do something like obviously release it like what I'm trying to say is let it out, let it out okay feel it because if you just suppress it it's just going to build up more and more and more so don't do that okay for some of you guys I am seeing here if you have someone safe to talk to about these things to do that because that's also going to help you heal okay talk your feelings out with someone how you're feeling um yeah I'm honestly getting a message here to be a little bit vulnerable it's okay like all of us go through obstacles all of us go through like this ten of wands energy okay like it's heavy it's really heavy and this guy already has his leg injured so um so yeah for some of you guys if you guys do feel comfortable with opening up to someone that will help you also and that's what the divine is just giving you as a suggestion okay this will help you to feel a little bit more at ease relieved okay uh, because there are emotions coming up and you guys may not be understanding like why am i so emotional why do i feel like crying why do i feel sad why do i feel regretful frustrated all these different things um but it's it is because you're healing so that's the message that's coming through just so that you guys are aware and not confused as to why you're feeling the way you're feeling but this is all like happening now when we get to your oracle here like gosh you guys what the heck i'm so happy um Yeah, I'm picking up that like these past two months, like August and September, if you're watching this when it's released, okay, this is a timeless, this is a timeless reading, um, but if you're watching this when it's released, yeah, I am seeing that August and the, and this month played a huge role into what you're about to embark in. I'm getting that next month you guys will see some you guys will start to see like a new beginning i don't know why i'm picking that up and you're turning into a, like i said pio when you're turning into a whole different person like yeah and you will start to see this because you guys are glowing you guys are shining like literally you guys are thriving pio one i am seeing you guys thrive here okay we even have the positive movement forward so <laughs> pile one like this is honestly kind of just a message of reassurance from the divine saying look everything's kind of everything is working out to plan your prayer your prayers are being answered okay the divine does not take your situation lightly don't think that they've forgotten about you or that they're not listening to you or uh, pile one even like i am getting this message here like even if you guys have made mistakes like you need to remind yourselves okay to those of you that are kind of hanging on to that um i am getting a slight message here some of you guys may be holding on to that and thinking like oh because i did that like i don't deserve this no 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 um yeah don't i'm not seeing like i'm seeing here to not be in that type of headspace okay like yeah, if you, if you feel like you did something wrong or anything like that, forgive yourselves, okay? Because the divine does that. Uh, of course, it might take time for you, 
for others maybe to forgive you as well. But uh, do it like towards yourself, especially for those of you guys. I am picking up someone here maybe blaming them themselves for something. Okay, everything's going to be fine. Your past doesn't define you. Um, and I am seeing here that like, yeah, that, 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 that's why mistakes I exist, right? So that you learn from them. So kind of like look at it in that way. Have you learned from them, right? And if you have, well then that's good. <laughs> uh, let's see here. We have 45, let your light shine. Mm, pile one, I keep getting here because even this like giraffe here, like in the background, it's glowing. Okay, there is something about you coming up. You are going to be thriving and I am seeing you get noticed. I'm not sure in what way. So you guys need to let me know down below if you guys feel comfortable. Okay, like maybe what you're praying for for or what you're hoping for. Uh yeah but you are going to be glowing you are going to be shining people are going to be noticing you basically i'm seeing obstacles end okay we have ten of swords ending and you also have two tens here okay the ten of wands and the ten of swords so you have ten ten so there and even the judgment another ten ten that becomes a 20 right so uh there definitely is like a lot of cycles ending okay and it's because you're becoming a new person you you guys have learned so much so first of all congratulations as well uh like with everything that you guys have gone through and just look at look at what you're going towards like this is the mindset kind of that the divine is letting you know in this message that they want you to have is to look forward to what's to come okay uh and keep being connected to the divine somehow okay if you guys do like to pray or however you you guys don't have to do that okay i just am seeing that maybe some of you guys do here okay um but however you like to stay connected even if it's just having hope okay that is your light okay that is your connection to the divine is that hope that you have so keep being connected um and i am seeing you guys in that energy Okay, with the Queen of Cups here, regardless of your gender, I, I am seeing that. Like, you guys are, like, like beneath it all, okay, there is something within you that, like, you have hope, Pile One. You have hope. So, <laughs> you are connected as well. You're very strongly connected, actually, here. So, Pile One, keep going. I love this message so much. Um... I think I wasn't planning to pull out like an extra card for this reading, but I think I will. Okay, and I've never, oh my god, these are such cute cards. I don't think, I don't think I've used these, these cards on this channel. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. But for some reason I got called to, okay, hold on. <laughs> Give me one second, Les. So can I get a little message from my pile one? From my pile one. You guys, these cards are so big. I don't know if I can shuffle them. Okay. From my pile one. There we go. Okay. No, I just want one. Okay, you guys got two. And you know what? I'm going to take them. Okay. <laughs> oh, these are so cute. I can't. So the first one says, It's okay to be afraid, but as much as you can, please try to act from love rather than fear. Ooh. And these are pretty self-explanatory, so I'm just going to leave it for you guys to... Um, to receive the message okay however it hits you so yeah loves this is so beautiful and then your second one says look at that little cat <laughs> her smile is so cute it's kind of like yeah <laughs> it's like cute but kind of evil at the same time anyways so it says everything is scary and you feel vulnerable but that doesn't mean anything is going to go oh but that doesn't mean anything is going to go wrong anxious feelings aren't usually in indic indicative of reality that's so true because um anyways yeah sorry loves <laughs> that's so true because i am picking up that some of you guys have fears coming up okay so and both of these are talking a little bit about fear 
okay so this is kind of just a reassurance loves that everything is gonna be fine and i was picking that up okay uh some of you guys are holding back a little bit okay too much to what has happened and pile one honestly don't blame yourselves for doing that we all we all do that because um it's kind of like our jerk reaction right when things are changing like oh my god like what what do i do you know so it's kind of our jerk reaction to just naturally hang on to what has happened and base things like off of what has happened as well like oh well that time this didn't go right so it's not gonna go right again you know like something like that is what i'm picking up here but yeah loves these are the messages from the divine for you guys for some reason uh you guys got to and yeah loves and i forgot to say the question of the day in the beginning of the video but the question for today is what is something that you did for yourself today okay um if you feel like you want to answer it please let me know down below and um if you guys are finding that maybe you didn't do anything for yourself today make sure that you do something for yourself tomorrow okay that does not mean that you can't give to anyone because giving is so beautiful giving of yourself is so beautiful but um i do want you guys like even if it's like t taking a bubble bath okay or whatever it is that you want to do for yourself pile one but make sure that you do something for yourself every day always okay <laughs> so yeah loves i'm gonna leave it at that i'm gonna go ahead and move on to my pile too and i will see you guys next time bye Hey, pile two for you guys that chose the moss agate. Let's go ahead and see what is it that, or what is the lighthearted message that Spirit has for you today? And after doing pile one, I'm just so happy to see the rest of the piles because, yeah. <laughs> mm, we have the five of swords. We have the eight of swords. We have justice. And we have the ace of pentacles. we have a soul love Aww. going forward i love that movement choices and decisions and then we have nine of cups oh my god pile two okay now i know why spirit wanted me to do this topic it's like this is really getting me in a good mood. I, I mean, I was already happy before this, but because um, just like the feeling that I was having overall with all three piles just felt really good for this reading. I, I mean, they're lighthearted messages, right? So I already knew that they were going to be nice, but just with what I picked up from pile one, what I'm seeing here, it's like making me happy, <laughs> more happy. Um, okay. Okay, pile two. All right, so what I'm seeing here in this pile, okay, the lighthearted message that Spirit has for you today. Some of you guys have been going through like some, like what I'm seeing here is like some mental conflict, okay? And I'm actually seeing that you're fighting this off so well like you guys are you guys are fighters pile two for whoever picked this pile okay you guys like it's almost like you guys have like accepted this challenge in the 5d <laughs> some of you guys in the 3d was or must be like i never accepted that challenge heck no like i don't like this because <laughs> you can be at any stage okay of feeling this way okay pile two um, some of you guys have maybe already resolved this mental conflict or some of you guys maybe were experien experiencing this recently or maybe still are, okay, for, for others of you guys. But pile two, basically what the divine is saying is you're going to come out of this, okay? If you're having any type of um, 
thoughts that are conflicting okay or that are making you feel confused or honestly i'm seeing stressed i'm seeing scared like you guys could just be feeling like i don't know what to do i feel trapped in my thoughts like this is too much what the divine is saying is like look don't worry about it they're just thoughts okay um and pile two i know definitely that that's easier said than done okay because i am picking up maybe these mental conflicts that you guys have been having pile to have maybe led to a little bit of anxiety okay and dealing with anxiety is never easy so hang in there pile two if you guys are still feeling this way okay I, I am getting a message here that the divine is saying just hang in there because what i'm seeing here Mm, the divine is saying that you're you're going to come out of this, okay? And you're going to come out of this very strong. Pile two. Very, very strong. Uh, so, yeah, just hang in there, okay? There's also a message here that they're, like, you guys, um, the divine wants to give you something. The divine wants to give you your due, okay and i am seeing that this is going to come your way it, it, like there's still time involved here okay but it's going to come your way and basically what they're saying here loves is you're going to have a wish fulfillment there's and not just one like i'm seeing here with the nine of club nine of cups it says blessings you will have your wish fulfillment and more okay for some of you guys i am seeing a new beginning and for some others of you guys, I'm seeing like some sort of commitment. I'm even seeing a proposal for some of you guys. Like I'm getting a lot <laughs> um, come your way. Okay, this proposal could be in any area of, area of your life. I am picking up and maybe like love. Something could be moving forward to like the next level. Okay, because it's meant to. And it could be that maybe you guys don't see this coming because you're telling yourself like all these things, like all these thoughts coming into your head and it's kind of making you feel worried, anxious, like, like, oh my God, I don't know. Um, And really pile to like, really, <laughs> this is beautiful stuff. This is like, a very very beautiful message mm, let's look at the rest of your energies we have strength as you're underlying oh oh <laughs> that one really wanted to pop out i take it out anyways but we have the six of cups as your crowning we have the ace of cups oh <laughs> and then we have the four of cups underneath mm, is the knight of swords okay So what's going on here? Okay. Yeah, some of you guys that picked my pile too. Uh, I'm getting like a mixture of emotions. Like some of you guys could be feeling really good at times, okay? Like you guys are content with yourselves good with what's there and then at other times i'm seeing you feel really unmotivated like i don't want to do anything because i'm not seeing anything like i'm not you know I, I, it's like when your mental conflict comes in i'm seeing you guys feel like unmotivated like nothing's moving like why should i try like that kind of energy okay um maybe some of you guys may be even feeling guarded okay and getting into like this energy of frustration okay yeah for some of you guys guys i am picking up a little bit of anger not too much i'm just getting a small portion of you mm. yeah and really piled to <laughs> what i'm seeing here is uh, is again there is something coming your way it's like and i don't hmm i i don't see you guys like seeing it come your way like it, it's gonna be unexpected is almost what i'm getting there's a lot of me different messages for my pile too it's like what <laughs> maybe a lot of you guys pick this pile for others of you i'm also getting that if you're connected to someone okay um and this is what you're worried about they're okay the person that you're connected to is a fighter okay so if you're worried about the person that you're connected to and whether like they're reflecting or if they're learning or something like that okay they are i am seeing that message very clearly 
Um, I am seeing that maybe the person that you're connected to could even be feeling guarded, okay, sometimes, and it's not their fault, it's because they're reflecting, it's because they're transitioning. I'm even seeing that um, if you're not the one that's feeling unmotivated, then it's them, okay? Now, this message is for those of you, like there's, like I said, pile two, sorry if I'm all, all over the place, I'm just, so many things are coming through. So like I said, for some of you guys, this is all within you. And for others of you guys, I am seeing that this is, uh, this could also be with someone that you're connected with. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And there's just a message here that there's a lot of reflection going on. Okay. You just need to allow it to happen. But there, there is a message about love here. Okay. Whoever this person is that you're connected with, um, that something beautiful will emerge out of this, okay? Because this person is becoming a different person. And I'm also seeing you evolve, pile two. It's like both of you guys are evolving. Both of you guys are at different stages. But at the same time, there's reflection. And there's a lot of fighting energy, pile two. Again, whether this is you or someone that you're connected with. But everything's good. Everything's good to go. Mm, I'm even seeing here with the strength card that pile two you and you know this down at your very core that you're highly connected to spirit okay like there is something within you where you really do trust like you trust the divine so much pile two so when you start to get into this overthinking or worrying or feeling scared even because i am picking that up for some of you guys the divine is saying to focus like i am seeing that here like they're saying focus 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 okay um, everything's good, okay, it, yeah, I'm seeing that maybe do things that'll make you feel happy, like, whether that's reading, I'm seeing do things that make your inner child happy, to make your inner child calm, because this is what's going to help you move forward, like, this is just advice that's coming through from the divine, um, just to make your journey a little bit easier on yourself, okay, yeah, yeah, but there is a fighting energy here, pile two, between you and this person. Like, fighting, like, fighting for a connection, okay? Like, yeah. Some of you guys may be worrying if, like, your person um, has the endurance to do so or something like that. And the answer is they do, pile two. So you don't, don't worry about that if that's something that you're worried about, okay? But, yeah, I just, I am seeing that. Now, for others of you guys, if this is within yourselves, you are going to get out of this energy, this energy of unfe like feeling unmotivated, feeling like something bad's going to happen, feeling scared, having all these like worst case scenarios come through your mind, okay? You are battling a lot of uh, thoughts right now, and that's what you need to keep doing is what the divine is saying is just keep battling them. Like if they come through, do something to help you get out of there. Um, out of that space of mind, okay? I, and I am seeing here that the divine is saying, like, think about us, think about... Mm, for some of you guys, what may help you is to think about, like, how the divine has helped you in the past, okay? It's almost like they're saying, like, you got through that, you're gonna get through this, okay? You will see something come out of this, and you will see a lot of blessings come your way, is what I'm seeing here. I'm even seeing, like, opportunities come your way, pile too with the movement uh, choices and decisions card here okay there is something that's coming up that you guys may have to make some choices but it's all gonna be like worth it like you guys are gonna be very happy to make these choices okay and this could be in any area of your life this isn't gonna be anything bad i'm even I, and i am getting loves that um again with the soul love card i am getting first of all that you're very loved by the divine okay that's one message very very loved like you have the divine connected through like like i don't know i, I just how to emphasize it loves how strongly you are connected with them okay yeah and, and maybe you just need to hear that as reassurance okay but and for others of you guys what i'm getting um yeah for others of you guys i'm also getting that the divine kind of speaks through you okay that's something else to remember the divine lives within you and with for others of you guys i am seeing that if this is resonating between you and someone that this is a love okay this is a true love i don't know why i am picking that up okay i'm also getting here um pile two with the going forward card that your path is clear like you guys have done so much work like the only thing that you're having to battle now is just 
it's just bad thoughts okay it's thoughts that may conflict you maybe some overthinking maybe like those what ifs what if this happens what if that happens um but you're moving forward pile two and your path is clear okay they're shining they're shining the way they're guiding you they're continuing to guide you and that's not to say that some days you you won't have low days because you will everyone has low days right um, but for the most part, pile two, like they're just continuing to guide you and they're saying that you are going to see something come up. And with the Ace of Pentacles and a Ace of Cups here, pile two, it is a new beginning. OK, and it is a tangible one. It is a tangible one. The divine is wanting to give you your due. You will have this. So, <laughs> yeah, Pile 2, this is your lighthearted message. Wow. Like, they're honestly coming out as, like, reassuring messages so far as what I've seen in Pile 1 and Pile 2. So, yeah. I'm just picking up that you guys could be struggling uh, or dealing with a lot of not feeling motivated. Um having like what if thoughts come through a lot okay and i just want to pull out a card for you guys pile two i was telling pile one that i've never used this deck before um and these cards are really big <laughs> so they're a little hard to shuffle but i got this <laughs> let's see can we get a message from my pile two Pile two. No. Okay. Pile two. Oh, look at that. It says, hey. <laughs> this is so cute. Mm. So it's, oh. This is so cute. It says, hey, you matter. Thanks for existing. <laughs> um, pile two, I'm picking up that like a lot of people admire you. Okay, a lot of people love you. And yeah, it like these messages are very self-explanatory. So I leave it for you guys. But I am just, I don't know why I felt the need to say that to my pile too. Like you really do matter. And a lot of people are thankful that you exist. Okay. Ooh, um, bottom of your deck, uh, bottom of your deck also says, don't focus on success or failure. Just focus on effort. Focus on trying. Oh my God. And that's so funny because like we did get that word focus, focus, focus in the middle of your reading and it's on the bottom of your deck as well. So don't focus on success or failure. Just focus on effort. Focus on trying. Honestly, loves what I'm getting with this message is you just need to take it day by day. Because, yeah, when you guys are in, like, going through anxiety or going through, like, these what-ifs and bad thoughts and fears, like, let's be honest, it's not so easy to just brush them off, right? Even if you do do things to make you feel better or div divert your mind, like, that does help. But sometimes, like, you can't help it. They, like, still come through, okay? So this message is coming through to just take it day by day, okay? Don't think so much out into the future, don't focus so much on your past. Focus on the right now, okay? Focus on that, like, and tell you, like, let yourself know, like, just accept you are doing your best, pile one. Like, what more can you do, right? Leave the rest up to the divine. That's the last message that I'm getting here. Surrender, leave the rest to the divine. You guys will see something because there's for sure no matter what, okay? Even if you guys keep going through these what ifs, there's a new beginning coming your way and it's gonna bring you your wish fulfillment basically in a nutshell okay pile two <laughs> so that's what i'm getting loves i think i'm gonna leave it at that i totally forgot to say the question of the day in the beginning of the video so the question of the day is what is something that you did for yourself today okay i don't care how small it was or how big it was but let me know what is something that you did for yourself today and if you're watching this and the answer is like that you didn't do anything for yourself today then um if you guys still have time please go do something for yourself something that makes you happy okay um and if like the day is over for you then maybe what's something that you can do for yourself tomorrow um but yeah loves i'm gonna leave it at that and 
personal readings are opened. All that info is down below, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! pile three for you guys that chose the tiger's eye let's go ahead and see what is the lighthearted message from spirit <laughs> um i was telling pile one and two that i've just been loving the messages like because it's a lighthearted message from spirit so i already knew they were gonna be really nice but i am pretty amazed as to the messages that they gave we have the page of pentacles the four of pentacles the ace of wands and we have the three of swords all right we have soul craft potential memories of love and three of cups celebration Ooh. <laughs> okay and okay so just give me a second loves to look at what you guys got here okay Okay, pile three. So what is the lighthearted message that the divine has for you? I'm picking up here that... Some of you guys could be experiencing like this feeling of feeling down about what it is that you have currently, okay, or maybe what it is that you have to offer, all right? And uh, I'm also seeing that some of you guys could be feeling like I'm, I'm honestly picking up like uh I don't know why I'm picking up at this in this pile, like a little bit of, like the emotions that are coming through okay are a bit like of uh, frustration or maybe even for some of you guys, I'm even picking up anger okay, like you guys could just be angry, mm, feeling a little bit possessive even okay, pile three, and that's okay, like there's Please do not be hard on yourselves, pile three. Um, this is something that the divine is wanting to bring up. Like, hey, you, you've been feeling like this and this, okay? And um, yeah, I'm seeing someone's like frustration and anger come out, okay? And pile three, just know that like there is something about healing here, okay? Like, and to let the feelings out, okay? Like, if you are feeling frustrated, if you're feeling angry, do not suppress it, okay? Let it out. Of course, you don't have to let it out on others, okay? But let it out if you feel like crying or whatever. Let that out as well. But for, yeah, for many of you, it's like, I'm seeing anger here, okay? So maybe do things that can, like, let out that emotion, whether that's maybe exercise would definitely be a good one okay <laughs> for some of you guys to like just let that energy out you just yeah now what the divine is letting you know pile three is there is a new beginning that's coming your way okay yeah there is a new beginning that's coming your way and some of you guys are See, what I'm picking up here is that what you guys are going through right now is teaching you like your true potential and really what you do have to offer. Because I'm picking up that some of you guys could maybe not see this about yourselves or maybe you haven't accepted this about yourselves that you deserve love, okay? That you are beautiful, that you have a lot to offer here, pile three. And... um Yeah, let me get the rest of your energy here. 
We have the Ace of Cups as your underlying. Oh, <laughs> we have the Four of Wands as your crowning. Mm. We have the Knight of Pentacles and we have the Six of Pentacles underneath. Oh, you guys, look at that. Ten of Cups. This is a beautiful message. The Divine is trying to show you this pile three. It's like the Divine is trying to show you your path to... Uh, being your authentic self, being your true self. And for some of you guys, I am seeing that this has taken you a while, okay? Like, naturally, your energy has been in this type of Knight of Pentacles state, okay? Like, a slower energy, okay? And it's completely fine, Pile 3. There's another message coming through that, like, the Divine is saying what's yours cannot be taken away from you. And this is something that you guys need to understand, you guys will have your Ten of Cups. Whatever your Ten of Cups is for you, okay? Uh, you guys will have a beautiful love. And I'm seeing union as well. For some of you guys, I'm even picking up mar marriage, okay? A beautiful home. Like, all of that stuff I'm seeing here, Pile 3. But what's going on is, um, yeah, I'm just picking up that, like, you guys could still be holding on to... For some of you guys, I am seeing that you guys still could be holding on to, like, some sort of, like, bad heat feelings, like, hurt feelings, okay? Uh, yeah, for some of you, I am picking that up. And what the Divine is saying is, like, look, we're gonna make you go through, like, a new beginning, and this is what's gonna heal you, okay? When you start to go through this new beginning that the Divine has planned for you, you are going to be healed and you are going to see so many things happen. There's also, uh, Pile 3, you guys are creators, I have to say. Like, honestly, uh, like, I'm amazed as to what I'm seeing. I don't think you guys see your true potential. You guys literally, um, Wow, like the message that's coming through is like you guys can turn things into gold, but you guys don't see that. Some of you guys don't are not aware of that. Some of you guys might be okay. Like eh, for all, for whoever's watching, you guys can be in any different phase of this. Okay, maybe you have already started a new beginning and you're and you can feel yourself slowly healing. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, and but pile three, what's going on here is that the divine is saying like you guys will create beautiful things maybe some of you guys may be working with your hands is what i'm picking up here okay uh yeah i am seeing something about hands okay working with your hands whatever your hands might be doing a lot of uh work here but you guys are creating and you guys have like a gift of making things look beautiful okay I'm also picking up that whoever picked this pile, you guys are very attractive. Uh, it could also be that maybe you guys don't see that, but you guys are very attractive, pile three. Okay, that's another message that's coming through. And what I'm seeing here is like your potential is going to burst. Okay, you might, de depending on what phase you're at on this journey, pile three, but the message that's coming through is you might not see your potential yet, but you guys will see it. it it's kind of, it's kind of, uh, the more that you heal pile three, the, uh, the more that you keep healing, the more and more and more that you're going to see more of your true self, your authentic self, your potential come out and you will be amazed as to the things that you attract. Okay. I'm also seeing here too, uh, like what might help you heal. Okay. Is think on beautiful, beautiful memories of love. Okay, like things that, things that make you happy. This could be love, like love encounters between friends, like you having really good friends or maybe even a romantic partner, uh, family, like anything that makes you remember like a good mem memory of love. Okay, the divine wants you to focus on like the positive. I keep getting that for you guys. Focusing on the positive is what's going to help you move forward because I am picking up here that someone is still holding on to bad feelings, okay? Like, um, in pile three, again, if someone did hurt you and, like, you're having trouble forgiving them or something like that, uh, just give yourself time, okay? That you can't force yourself to forgive overnight or anything like that, okay? And honest, and forgiving doesn't make like the other 
a person's actions valid or okay okay it's not that it's on it's for yourself forgiving is for yourself okay to move forward um because i, I keep picking up that energy that someone like this could be the reason maybe why you're still a little bit angry and this could be due to many like maybe even more uh, other like several past situations okay it doesn't even have to deal with just one specific situation or one person this could be many things from your past okay but it's like all built up inside you and you're still holding on to it and that's what's kind of making you not see like what's ahead of you okay and like pile three honestly the divine is saying like you're gonna you're gonna let go of it naturally like you don't even have to be aware about it okay this is gonna happen because i'm seeing the divine i don't know how this new beginning is gonna come about okay they're not being very detailed here but there isn't new beginning coming your way like i'm seeing the divine interfering honestly a new beginning coming your way and with whatever however this journey takes you pile three this is how you're going to heal okay um is what i'm picking up here and again they're saying like you you will have your happy family you will have a happy success for most of you guys i'm seeing a family okay but whatever the ten of cups means to you pile three you will have a union you will like the divine wants to give you all of these things okay so they're not against you or anything at all i'm even seeing celebrations in the future okay so loves what they're letting you know is like you have so much potential and you're gonna see it come out no matter what you are gonna see it come out it, yeah it's gonna be different for all of you guys how this comes out okay but it will for others of you guys i'm even seeing that if you are connected to someone okay um someone is coming into your life okay even if you're not connected to someone if you are expect like if you're wanting someone new then the universe is going to give you this as well okay yeah loves <laughs> um but for others of you guys i'm seeing this as like a self message like you have been taking your time to move forward okay and you're gonna keep growing like this is all you okay for others of you guys this does deal with uh, like there is a slight message for others of you that there is someone connected to you that's coming towards you okay but yeah loves there you you guys are moving forward basically and you guys will see so many beautiful things like after this new beginning starts and you truly start to heal okay because some of you guys still have to go through real healing that maybe you just haven't done yet okay and it's gonna happen and there's something about you creating stuff and and pile three you might be surprised like i feel like you guys might surprise yourself as to like wow i never thought like i'm seeing talent here you guys are very talented and some of you guys like may not think this or maybe haven't seen this okay this side of you maybe because like you guys just have been through a lot pile three and yeah what the divine is saying is like you will see yourself create beautiful things um you guys have a talent <laughs> so yeah let's keep going because this is beautiful your potential is seriously going to burst they're making sure of this like the universe is saying like they deserve this they deserve a new beginning they deserve to heal the proper way they deserve to have um new beginnings their ten of cups their four of wands like all of that loves so let me just get to you guys a little message here for my pile three what is another message for my pile three And also, yeah, like you guys recognizing your self-worth. I am seeing that as well. Message from the pile three. I was telling pile one and pile two that this deck is a bit big. <laughs> so it's a little hard to shuffle. Ow. There we go. There we go. Okay, so you guys have... Oh, see? Okay. 
Oh, it says there's no need to be so hard on yourself. You're managing as best as you can. And yeah, this is like where I keep getting some sort of energy where some of you guys are getting frustrated or angry or something like that, okay? Uh, there is a message here to be compassionate uh, with, for yourselves, okay? Like I was saying loves, like forgiveness, that's going to come with its own timing. Honestly, you don't even have to focus on it. Like the divine knows what they're putting in front of you so that you go through these things Um on your own timing, okay? And in your own way, forgiveness is different for everyone, loves, okay? Again, it doesn't mean that the person, what they did or the situation that you were in was okay, uh, but it's for yourself. And you guys really need to be a little bit easier on yourselves. It could be that you guys are har harsh on yourselves. So yeah, and, and that would create like you being harsh on others maybe even. Okay, so I am saying to be compassionate, loves. Okay, Com be compassionate. Be gentle with yourselves. Okay, you guys are doing the best that you can. And here, bottom of the deck says, feeling worried doesn't mean anything bad is going to happen. You're going to get through this fine. You always find a way. <laughs> um, and this is just like kind of reassurance loves, like everything is going to be fine. The divine is interfering here. The divine is wanting to help you, tr uh, is, is interfering to help you to truly heal here, okay? It's time for you guys to truly heal is what I'm getting. So yeah, loves, and this is, and from here on out, this is when you're slowly going to see your soul emerge okay your potential your craft your talents come out you will see so many things love loves like you might not see it right now of course because of whatever it is that you're going through but who knows like i'm just seeing like months from now okay things are changing things are changing you will see beautiful things so yeah loves i think i'm gonna leave it at that i totally forgot to mention the question of the day in the beginning of the video so it was just, um, what is something that you did for yourself today? Okay. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's the question. And I think I'm going to leave it at that, loves. I don't think there's anything else. Private readings are opened. All of that info is down below. And I will be coming out with a love reading tomorrow. So if you guys are interested in that, that'll be up tomorrow. And yeah, loves, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.